Good morning. And my name is Julian Hampton, and I'm the Associate Director for the Apartment Works Program. And today, I'm so excited to welcome you to our 27th Apartment Works graduation. Now, for those who are unfamiliar with JVS SoCal, we, offer, we are a nonprofit agency celebrating our 90th year legacy of service. Um, it's a long time, and uh, we've been offering hope and opportunity to our diverse Southern California community since 1931. Now, many things have changed since our founding, except one thing that has remained constant over the decades, encapsulated in our mission statement. We, build, we are building better lives one job at a time by empowering individuals to achieve dignity and economic independence through sustainable employment. Apartment Works is a signature job training program for JVS SoCal since it launched in 2014. And it's the critical support and engagement of our generous donors and partners that enable us to offer programs like Apartment Works at no cost to our participants. And without the support of our generous funders, we wouldn't be able to deliver the Apartment Works program successfully. And our wonderful JVS Works team, whose hard work behind the scenes makes a huge difference in the success of our students. I'd like to now introduce you to Randy Lappin, the Senior Vice President of Philanthropy, with a special message to our partners and our sponsors. I'm Randy Lappin, Senior Vice President of Philanthropy here at JVS SoCal. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank all the funding partners that support the Apartment Works Career Training Program. Our funding partners include of the Apartment Association of Greater Los Angeles, Avalon Bay Communities, Bank of America, Bear Paints, California Employment Training Panel, CAMT, Cedar Sinai Health Systems, CIT Bank North America. City National Bank, Comerica Bank, the Don Levin Trust, Graystar, Harbor Freight Tools, the Jewish Community Foundation, the National Apartment Association, Pacific Western Bank, the Faffinger Foundation, the Cheryl Saban Self-Worth Foundation for Women and Girls, the JBS SoCal Women's Leadership Network, Union Bank, and Wells Fargo. We simply cannot do the work we do without all of you. We also wanna thank the many other generous and thoughtful donors, too numerous to mention, who support the work of JVS SoCal each and every day on this journey together, changing lives, one person, one family, one job at a time. If you are not yet a funding partner of ours and you're recruiting our amazing graduates for your workforce, We'd like to have a conversation about becoming a full-fledged employer partner sponsor and enjoy the benefits of great corporate brand awareness and other special opportunities we offer. Our goal is to keep this program tuition free for our students, but JBS cannot do it alone. The Apartment Works team knows how to reach me. We also wanna welcome our recruiter guests at today's graduation, Air Communities, CIM Group, Decron Properties, Related, Equity Residential, Goldcrest, Goldrich Kest, Graystar, GHP Management, IMT Residential, and CRG Residential. We also have several board members present from JVS SoCal. Please welcome our board chair, Leland Felsenthal, Harris Smith, and Rick Powell. Forgive me if I've missed anyone. A big shout out to the entire JVS Works team for the great work you do each and every day, making our career trading program so successful. Finally, and most important, here's to you, our graduates. Congratulations. Good luck in your new careers. Before I introduce Denise Silva, allow me to say a few words about our keynote speaker today, Larry Callistat. Graystar and Larry Callistead have been great friends and partners and generous supporters of our Apartment Works program for more than three years now. Can't say enough about their support and passion for the work we do together. I look forward to his keynote remarks coming up shortly. 
And now it's my honor to introduce Denise Silva, whose, ha whose hard work and commitment have enabled to make the Apartment Works program a marquee program for JBS SoCal and our community. Denise, take it away. Good morning, everyone. And thank you for joining us. At JVS SoCal, we view our training programs as an opportunity for meaningful employment, livable wages, and long-term career growth. The Apartment Works program has been successful, uniquely successful for many reasons, as it attracts and retains a diverse audience of students. After graduates complete their one-year provisional retention, they become nationally certified and recognized for their field through the National Apartment Association. The Apartment Works program excels above other competitors as it holds great results with completion rates and high job placements. We have utilized innovative methods uh, to have these classes um, and in a safe working environment. This accelerated training program provides opportunities for personal growth, placements into essential jobs, which leads to an unlimited number of career connections and opportunities. Through the eight weeks, we've been able to provide our CAMT uh, participants a blended training environment through Zoom and in person. The 27th Apartment Works class learned various skills in the accelerated courses in interior and exterior repair electrical, plumbing, appliance repair, and an intro to HVAC and also professional development that is very important in this field. Our class genuinely appreciates everyone that took the time in the evenings out of their own schedules to dedicate a few minutes and welcome them with open arms into the industry. We had past visitors from uh, Graystar, Decron, uh, equity residential and IMT residential to come and meet with the class briefly and share the tips to be successful in the field. They've learned the importance of providing the best quality of service in the industry and stay motivated to overcome any challenges. All of our participants have been extremely thankful for this opportunity. The Apartment Works program wouldn't be possible without the help of all of our generous sponsors and employer partners that help the program grow. Before we go any further, I would like to present to you our employer keynote speaker for today's graduation. Please welcome Larry Callistad. Thank you so very much. Really appreciate this. And uh, thank you so much, Randy, for your kind words earlier. Um, good morning, JVS graduates. Good morning, JVS funding partners all current and future employers, JVS executives, JVS board members, and all our guests here today. Uh, today we celebrate a special day um, as, a SNEC, as a SNEC cohort graduate from this fantastic Apartment Works program. Today we celebrate the achievements and milestones of a very special group of people. Today we celebrate you, the JVS Apartment Work graduates, all of your recent accomplishments that you have made. I do wish that we could be in person as we were a few years ago, a couple of years ago, because I got a chance to shake hands and get to know each one of you in person individually. Unfortunately, we can't do that today, but hopefully we can very soon. Approximately four years ago, our company Graystar forged a partnership with JBS SoCal. It didn't take me very long when I was introduced to this JBS platform and what they were all about for me to really take notice. To all those companies that have joined this graduation ceremony today, it is important for you to understand that JVS's mission is to alleviate the financial burdens of those people that are struggling with food and housing insecurity by offering career training programs to individuals that face high barriers to employment and then offering them a robust training program that leads to satisfying careers within the apartment industry. These graduates are offered specific maintenance training, guidance, support services, and opportunity to learn, also learn soft skills, which ultimately leads to job placement. I am very proud to be a financial contributor and partner to this fantastic organization that not only offers hope to know those that need it the most, but also opens the doors to long-term career growth within our industry. Since 2018 here at Graystar in, Los in the Los Angeles region, we have hired a total of 34 GVS graduates to fill our open maintenance technician positions. And like our alumnus speak, alum speaker, you will hear late from late, later this morning, 
28 of those graduates still work for our company, with many of them on their way to promotions in the near future. To all of you graduates that are here today, this could be a pivotal point in your career. There are companies ready here today to interview you, just like us, and you should be ready to also ask them questions that you may have. I will never forget back in the day when I was a leasing consultant, yes, a long time ago, and had spent two years leasing apartments at New York University. And then a job opening was posted within our company that I was, that I was working for, and that job was an assistant manager role. I didn't know if I was quite ready for that, but I applied for the position anyways, because number one, I knew it would pay more. Yes, I did have dollar signs in my eyes. And number two, I really wanted to challenge myself by advancing in my career. I went to the interview very nervous, and because I only partially knew what that position involved, I still had a lot to learn. I began to ask a lot of questions near the end of the interview. And then after I left, I thought to myself, wow, this hiring manager must think that I talk too much and they think that I ask way too many questions. There's no way I've got, I got the job. And the very next day that hiring manager called me and offered me that position. He said that he liked all of the questions that, and that I showed interest by asking all those questions and showed interest in this new assistant manager job. Going in, I had a real fear of failure, but I succeeded because I knew that when you work hard, show up early, are very interested, stay late if needed, I could go far in my career. In closing, to JVS graduates here today, remember these things. If you go into the interview with a positive attitude, your interviewer will notice that. If you know that you have the skills to do the job, we will figure that out after we talk to you. And if you know how to deliver excellent customer service, one of these companies here today will hire you. We will be part of your career growth. Today could be a turning point in your life. One of the graduates that works for us here at Graystar recently told me that he needed a change in his life. And we hired him after, this gra after a graduation ceremony. Two years later, he has been promoted here to senior maintenance technician. And finally, what is most important is that you always do the right thing. If you live by that, you will be amazed how successful you will be. I wanted to thank JVS. I wanted to thank you, Janet, you, Denise, and you, Randy, for allowing me to speak on behalf of Graystar. And I look forward to partnering with you, JVS, for many, many years to come. Thank you. So thank you, Larry. We really appreciate you and your Welcome. continued involvement with your program works program, definitely. Now it's time to shine the spotlight on our uh, Apartment Works instructor who has been very instrumental with the technical training and great mentor for our students. Please welcome our Apartment Works instructor, uh, Jonathan Kwok. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, friends and families of JVS Apartment Works. And also I wanna welcome our graduates. First and foremost, I want to thank you for all your hard work that you guys have done you guys have done a really great job and I'm really proud of you. I just wanna leave you guys with one quick uh, word that you guys can remember. The word is called legacy. What is a legacy? Especially a legacy of a person. It's when a person dies, the mark of an individual left on the world that represents that individual's legacy. It is the rich, it's about the richness and fullness of the individual's life, including what the person accomplished and the impact he or she had on people and places. Ultimately, the story of a person's life reflects the individual's legacy. So graduates, I know that you guys worked hard. I know I, I liked your attitude, your willingness to learn and do a lot of the hands-on. So I'm super uh, proud and I know I'm confident that with your attitude, that you guys will be able to leave a wonderful legacy of wherever you guys go in your life, in your place, and the people that you meet. So thank you so much. And I know that you guys will do really well. Take care and God bless. Thank you, John. Now, at this moment, we are happy to shine the spotlight on a JVS Apartment Works graduate from November 2019. I'm thrilled to introduce Jose Rios Marquez from Graystar. My name is Jose Rios Marquez. I'm an alumnus from 2019 class session 20. I believe you are 27, so congratulations on that. Um, well, welcome to the family, you know, JVS alumni and hopefully future success stories. Um, I'm very, very grateful um, for the program that the program does exist. 
Um, otherwise, I wouldn't be where I'm at right now, which uh, I work in downtown LA for Graystar. It's a pretty big property with 604 units. And just recently I was promoted to senior tech. Um, so there's, there's always room for growth. You just have to persevere and just keep working hard. Even when things don't look like they're going the right way, uh, just keep doing what you need to do. Just like in JVS program, you know, sometimes it seems like it's too much work. There's a lot of things to learn. You don't have enough time. Um, the time, like they say, will be a lot more hectic once you start working. Um, personally, just get whatever you can so that you can grow within the industry. Uh, we've been in the pandemic ever since. And I was lucky, like I said, that I did get a job just about a month after graduation. I've not had any layoffs or anything ever since. So it's it's a security. It's like to say, you know, it's one of the best industries to be in. And I'm very, very thankful to that, um, to the fact that I was able to get my camp T after a year. I, I did come from insurance sales, which is extremely highly stressful job environment. And then after that, you know, the industry changes. I was doing a little bit of uh, ride sharing Uber slash Lyft. Um, so uh, money was really tight. And with this industry, you can keep on growing. I've had it a steady increase here. Um, so the money, the money aspect is, it's, it's good and it's just, it can go up higher. Um, if you're really good and dedicated and have a good place, uh, five, seven years, you could become a, a regional manager or something of the like, um, especially depending on your companies. If it's a smaller company, you might be able to move up faster. And if it's a bigger company where it's always expanding, they're always looking for more personal, you can always ex expect to move up as well. So the industry is, is booming. They're not stopping. Everyone always needs a place to stay and there's always people moving in and moving out. So with regard to that, you pick the correct industry, you will be able to find a job. You're in the right place. Um, whether you find the job right away or not, or the desired company you wanted to, just keep on moving forward, keep on moving, keep on moving. And you will, you will time, you put in a dedication, you will definitely move up. Uh, personally, for my year, I want to thank Denise and John, everyone else there. I want to thank all the sponsors that have made it possible up to this point and continue contributing. Thank you very much. This is a great program. I personally, you know, I, I'm very, very thankful that I have not just a, a job to go. Now it's going to be a career, you know, something in the future. I have something to look forward to. And there are many benefits that come with the job itself depending on which company you get hired to. Thank you very much. And then once again, congratulations. And uh, look forward to perhaps seeing you on the field. Thank you so much, Jose. Um, really appreciate your hard work at Be Downtown LA and your continued dedication for being one of the best role models for our program and our apartment communities. All right, now it's that moment that you've all been waiting for patiently. It's time to shine the spotlight to our graduating class of Apartment Works 27. Our first graduate is Caitlin Haggerty. When I first met Caitlin, she first uh, thought that this program was a scam because she found it off of Craigslist. And as she was accepted into the training program, she realized the many opportunities that JVS has to offer into the apartment field. She has four years of customer service in retail and hospitality. Uh, she is well experienced with difficult customers since she worked for 7-Eleven and had some hands-on experience working as a custodian for Glendale Unified School District and a housekeeper for Extended Stay America because she wants to join this program to empower more women to join this industry. And that makes me happy. Congratulations, Kaylin. Our next graduate is Kevin Simpson. Everyone in class loved having Kevin around because of his people skills. He got along great with everyone, no matter what the environment was. And that is because he knows how to perform at his very best. During class, uh, he was always determined to learn everything hands-on. And if there was something that he did not understand, he was not afraid to ask. 
In the end, he became very confident and always volunteered to further assist with projects. Kevin has a good sense of humor and a great communicator because he is a professional comedian. But he too faced many struggles during the pandemic. And he has realized that it is time to have a steady job income by becoming an essential worker in the apartment industry. Congratulations, Kevin. And I can't wait to hear your success story later on. Our next graduate is Marco Flores. If you currently have Marco's resume right in front of you, don't think that everything listed in that one page resume is everything that he did. So try condensing a two page resume that covered four supervisory positions while working in the military. It was so hard to cut because of the extensive number of achievements and responsibilities under his belt. It's like gold. So if you want to see it, go ahead and ask them for it. But um, I know that our employer partners are going to be able to highly trust him because of his good leadership skills. And because he is well-disciplined US Air Force veteran, always on time and up to the trainings. While at the military, he was a maintenance supervisor and was responsible for various positions and munitions systems. Marco has a desire and determined to achieve success. His long-term goal is to become an engineer and one day be able to transfer to the school of his dreams, UCLA. Congratulations, Marco, and it was a pleasure having you in class. Our next graduate is Richard Carbajal. If you want someone in your organization that has strong, effective communication skills, then Richard will be your go-to person to um, have in your team, as he was awarded a Distinguished Toastmaster Award. In addition, he has over 15 years of customer service experience in sales, 10 years installing laminate flooring, nine years of working for the city of Torrance in maintenance, and uh, he is a big advocate with community fundraising for St. Jude's Hospital, Children's Hospital every year. It's a pleasure having him in class because of the great energy that he had. And I'm very confident that he will be one of the very best in the industry. Congratulations, Richard. Our next graduate is Sharif Elfar. I am highly impressed with Sharif's persistence to keep working on his goals, even when he turns into roadblocks, it turns into roadblocks along the way. Last year, he got in a, uh, he was accepted and completed a pre-apprentice carpentry training program. But in the end, due to the pandemic, it became a little bit more hard uh, to complete it thoroughly, be placed in a job and accept a certificate because it, the program pretty much just shut down uh, because of the pandemic and its limits. As a result, everyone, um, you know, had struggles with the job placements and they had no support. Luckily, he came across apartment works training in uh, from Craigslist and decided to, to give it a try since it was um, one of the very few programs that was actively training in a safe working environment. He has curb appeal uh, background after working for Canyon Home Maintenance for two years. A few highlights that you could take note of is that he is bilingual in English and Arabic. And uh, during his days off, he enjoys volunteering for a nonprofit animal sanctuary. It was a pleasure having him in class. I'm highly impressed, especially when his, um, it was time to replace the battery to his hybrid. Uh, he knew that he wasn't gonna be spending thousands of dollars and he would figure out on his own on how to take care of that himself. So anything that comes with technical, he will definitely figure it out. Congratulations so far. Our next graduate is uh, Stefan Jackson. Stefan became inspired to join the program after seeing his brother Zane Lopez successfully complete the training and uh, spoke highly about this journey as a service technician. During the training, Stefan was very alert, lively, and ready to engage energetically. No matter what the situation, he always had that can-do attitude to get his hands dirty and help others during cross-training. If your community is aiming and beating records for zero days without injuries, 
then Stefan can be highly trusted with that task as he was responsible for the safety of over 250 people while working for Pacific Harbor Line. There, he beat the record of having no work injuries for six consistent years in a highly injury field uh, working for the railroads. Stefan is a strong problem solver and very well knowledgeable in plumbing since his family and friends are always calling him for their plumbing needs. Congratulations, Mr. Jackson. Now, you guys could all unmute yourselves, mute those microphones, and let's recognize the graduating class, of JVS Works, Apartment Works, 27. Yeah, great job. Thank you. 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 <laughs> right. And as we're going to go into our closing remarks, because we are not done yet, um, to all of our graduates, we have a special message for you. It was such an honor to have you all in class to be able to empower you and teach you very valuable skills needed to be successful, not just in your career, but also in life itself. The rest of the JVS Works team and I will always be here to provide support and guidance and create meaningful changes to your lives. We just simply ask you to pay it forward uh, by staying connected with us. You are part of our family now. We rely on you too to be Apartment Works ambassadors and recommend the program and encouraging those that you know to apply. Uh, you too can help change someone else's life. You are part of a meaningful legacy and future graduates will look up to you and admire you. Congratulations one more time. And um, as we, before we end, here is our program coordinator, Jenna Kiros, uh, to close the ceremony. Thank you everyone and stay safe. <laughs> Thank you, Denise. Thank you all for joining us for the milestone event as we help our graduates launch new careers and build better lives for their families and themselves. Apartment Works is the perfect illustration of the public, private, philanthropic, and nonprofit partnership. By combining our resources and expertise, we have the power to change lives. No single one of us can do it alone, but this program demonstrates what we can do together. And now for a few announcements. Don't forget to like us, follow us, and share your experiences on social media so you can help us spread the word about these amazing programs. Now, as soon as we finish, we'd like all the recruiters to prepare themselves to interview some amazing candidates. At that point, we will also ask that all the guests who have joined us online in support of our graduates log off so interviews can take place without interruption or distractions. Thank you again and have a great day. <laughs>